No fear. Gonna be awesome. Why isn't he turning off the lights? Gee, thanks, Sheriff. You okay? Couldn't be better. Hey, where were you sitting? Kind of all over. You check the cab. I'll check the bed. There you are. Is that what the sheriff wanted? Huh, it's just numbers. Department of Water and Power, $12,000. East Side Land Holdings, $8,000. There's hundreds of these. What are they, bribes or something? Hey, you all right? It's nothing, just that we're so caught up in all this shit. You, me, the sheriff, my family. If you knew what I've seen the last few weeks, it's all just so messed up. <sighs> it must be hard. I know I hated my life when I was your age. I was fat, my dad was never around. Mine was. You ever have something you thought about doing, but you knew it was too dumb to actually go do? Sure. I used to be an aircraft mechanic. Fixed up 747s and little Cessnas and everything. But when I was a kid, I didn't want to fix planes, I wanted to fly them. In fact, what I really wanted to be was a flight instructor. So why didn't you? Yes, life happened, got older, other things felt more important. But seeing how everything turned out, maybe I should have tried. I always wanted to be a forest ranger. Wanted to go to that one place with the geyser. What's it called? Yellowstone. Yeah, that's the one. See that thing spout in the air? That'd be cool. Tell you what, let's get out of here alive tonight. Maybe we'll both get to rethink our lives a little. We should be getting back. You ever been married? Sure, to Vince's mother. I was too once. She left me, said I drank too much. Wait, that's it, Sharon's bar. Didn't you come through here, what, 15, 20 years ago? Said you were some traveling salesman or something. Hey, I am telling you, drop it. Hey, we got it. Well, look at you two, a regular Thelma and Louise. Holy Moses, what is all this? Sheriffs are elected, right? So all those names and cash amounts, could could he be paying out bribes or something? Paying them, taking them, and probably a lot more besides. He's been dirty as a dog for years now. Just can't believe he wrote it all down. Put me through to the sheriff again. 
I know. I'm inside it. Dante, it's Sharon. Your little whack-a-mole in here betrayed you. I've got your little black book, and I'll gladly start faxing pages to Channel 10 unless you get me that bus in the next 30 minutes. How long till the FBI gets here? Under an hour. All right, Sharon. You win. Boss, you sure? We could wait him out. Bring the goddamn bus. You shouldn't have come. It's not safe. Those cops, they shoot first, ask questions later. We all agree. I'm not gonna let you. I hope she keeps on sleeping. Shouldn't be much longer now. How are you doing? About Michelle. I know she'll survive. I don't think our marriage will. Oh, son. You know, I kept blaming her for everything that happened to me. For things she said after the accident, for encouraging me to take that pet food job. Hmm. But she was just trying to help me move on. You've had a rough year, Vance. I'm sure it was hard for her, too. I know what I want to do about those settlement papers she wanted me to sign. Once we get out of here. Oh? I'm not gonna do it. I know where she was coming from, but... I'm gonna hire a lawyer and sue those bastards for all they're worth. Really? In the car earlier, I was just giving you a hard time. Huh. No, you were right. It doesn't even matter if I win. I'm just not gonna take it lying down. Huh. Then I'm proud of you, son. You mean... I guess that bus will be here any minute. We can't go home again? Wait, Vince. Grow up. Didn't even realize In how case we don't make it. Ah, uh, Jesus. Okay, look. My cancer. It's not as bad as I made it out. In fact, it... Uh, it doesn't exist. I made it up. What? A year or so ago, my closest friend Tony passed. And suddenly, I was alone in the world. My brother was long gone. I had nobody left. Except you. But... After everything I'd done, the way I left you, I, I knew you wouldn't let me back in your life unless... You gotta believe me, Vance. It came from a good place. You did all that? Just so I'd accept you in my life again? Would you have, otherwise? Probably not. And what about now, son? Can you give me another chance? Look, you're my dad. For better or for worse. And if you'd asked yesterday, I would have said no. But after tonight, I know I'm a lousy person. People can change, Dad. Just promise you'll never lie to me again. <sighs> you have my word. Yeah, hi. Is Jessica there? Uh, it's Dale. Dale Halt? No. The one they caught shoplifting. Yeah, yeah, that's me. Look, I've I seen you work in that liquor store sometimes, and well, there's that bar near there, you know, the one with the pool table and all? And I just was wondering if, um, you'd want to go there with me sometime. Well, all right. It's a date. Everybody, 
On your feet. Listen, everyone. The only way any of us gets out of here tonight is on that bus. Hostages at the windows, us in the aisle. You sure this is gonna work? Won't pretend I'm sure of anything. But I know what this family's capable of. Why is the chassis so low? Huh? Get out of the way! Bus is open. I repeat, bus is open. Take them out! Jay, get up. What? Pa? Are you hurt? I need you to drive me to the hospital. Get dressed. Don't worry, Pa. I'll get you there. I understand why you told your mom about the dead. But you got her all wound up and worried now. I just wanted to do the right thing. I know, son. But sometimes doing the right thing is doing the wrong thing. You'll understand that someday. <laughs> she used to think she could fix me, you know. All she wanted was a good man who'd love her back. Nobody wants to be alone. Not least your ma, anyway. So, when a woman like that says she wants you gone... Well, you start thinking maybe she's right. Maybe the family don't need me no more. Even I know when to cash in the chips. You gotta stop. I've tried, son. But once you get a taste for winning, you just want it more. Turn off here. The hospital's the other way. We ain't going to the hospital. Huh? Make the turn. How did you... How did you hurt your shoulder, Pa? You're a good kid. I know they say you're not supposed to have favorites, but... Tyler's trouble is too like his ma. Dale's is that he's too much like me. You're different. I can talk to you, so... Trust you. stopped here. Help me get this tarp off the back. It's heavy. Pa, what's inside? You got it? Pull. Keep pulling. Come on. Is 
he dead? Jay, you have to listen to me. He threatened us. You heard him. So I, I went to warn him off. That's all. He attacked me, and I hit him. Uh, too hard. He fell and hit his head. I, I didn't mean to kill him. I just panicked. I guess he just got what was coming. It wasn't your fault. Exactly. You lay down with dogs, you get fleas. That's what my pappy always told me. These people are sharks. You let them smell blood, and they'll eat you whole. I wish I gave him the watch. Ain't just any old watch, son. Like I said, belong to my dear old pappy. And now, it's yours. So you keep it someplace safe. Okay. See if he's got any cash on him. I don't know if I can do that, Pa. Ain't no use to him now. All the same. It still doesn't feel right. Pa, what are we gonna do? He's dead. Only one thing to do. Dig. Uh, please, don't ask me to do that. Jay, listen to me. No one can find him. If we don't do this, the people he works for... Please, I ain't asking for me. Think of your mom. Think of your brothers. You're the only one I can trust. Pick up the shovel. I... I can't. Sorry. You want a job done properly, you gotta do it yourself. Now listen. When I was half your age, we had this young horse. Beautiful colt. Rode him most days. Then, one summer, he threw me. Started bucking and biting. I was lucky he didn't kill me. Next day, Pappy hands me his rifle. Says, when an animal goes bad, all a man can do is put it down. Yeah, I can still smell his whiskey breath as he holds that horse steady. Counts to three. I squeeze the trigger and all those years I hated him. Now I know he was right. It had to be done, son. You hear me? It had to be. Please. Oh, oh, shit. <laughs> we gotta cover him up before he... Help me. Trust me, son. We'll be doing him a mercy. Help me. Please. Bury him. Do it, Jay. Do it, Jay. Bury him. We have to help him, Pa. Then I'll do it myself. Oh, God. Jay.
look like you need it. Not for me. Too early. Ain't early. It's late. Still, no thanks. Well, after tonight, I do. You take care of your grandpappy's watch, you hear? Been keeping time on a Holt's wrist since the Great Depression. So you treasure it. Look, what happened tonight? It wasn't easy for me, neither. But I did it for all of us. And I don't blame you for thinking bad of me. I, I know I'm hard on you sometimes. And maybe I'm just no good. But I've made a lot of sacrifices, Jay. Going off to war. Taking care of that stranger tonight. Family means sacrifice. Even for a fucked up old drunk like me. They got places you can go, you know? Meetings? You can get help. Oh, they don't help old dogs like me. They just put them down. You saved a man's life tonight. And that makes you a better man than me. But it won't change things. It's my blood they'll want. It doesn't have to be like this. We can go to the cops. And tell them what? I tried to kill a man and bury him alive? These people. They ain't afraid of the law. <sighs> I brought this on us. So, it's on me to fix it. Now, get some sleep. I'm gonna go fix that roof you boys messed up. Sharon, you're not right about much, but you were right about me. Claim the insurance, it'll clear the debt. Sorry for everything. Pa! Pa! Let me do this. Please. Don't die! Don't die! You should have left me. You're still my pa. I don't want to lose you. Life ain't about what you want. Your boy's act of mercy towards me buys you two weeks. But the debt remains. And if we don't pay? The next time you see me and my friends outside, you'll be digging your own graves. Oh, God, Bear, if you'd only talk to me. Now he's got so many pipes and tubes sticking out of him. He ain't gonna be saying anything. For now. Should have let him swing. Two weeks? Even if we had two years, we couldn't raise that kind of cash.
It's vintage. Valuable, I think. <laughs> that old thing? It's a fake. Trust me. Pa couldn't even give it away. You want to hear my pitch? I say we rob the bank. Could work. Dumb right. Now, hold on. Nobody is robbing a bank. It's too risky. But maybe there's another way. Support. Ma, it's over. We can't win. Dear God, please let this work. What are you doing? Improvising. Oh, shit! Run, run, run! You okay? I'm fine. Keep going. We're not safe yet. Daddy, I, I can't breathe. God. The whole fucking place is on fire. Oh God, I hope Paul got out. How do we get out? There's a window. is going up. We're gonna have to jump. It's too high. I'll get hurt. How about Grandpa goes first, okay? Uh. Uh. See you down there, Squirt. <laughs> Grab my hands. Here we go. Uh. 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 Okay, Pumpkin. You ready? Please. Don't make me. <laughs> the flames are coming up the stairs. We need to go now. Go on, Joyce. We're right behind you. <laughs> Look out! Are you all right? <laughs> Climb down. I'll find another way. The bathroom at the end of the hall. I'll see you down there. <laughs> we have to run for it. Should we hold our breath? Good idea. Yes. <laughs> I'll have to boost you up. I'll be right behind you, I promise. Will you fit? I'm not that big. Ready? <laughs> Up you go! Get on my back. Now hold on tight. Quick, away.
away from the flames. Two zero eight four. We have multiple officers down. Abandon the hilltop. We need urgent backup. We're headed down now. Over. What a freaking mess. I don't want to go back home to Sacramento. If we hadn't come, then none of this would have happened. You're right, Pumpkin. But there was no way. We could have known. Come on, kiddo. <gasps> Zeus! That was the lowest setting. You don't want to feel it on the highest. Sheriff, this is Coburn. Are you still in the back? Do you need support? Negative, Coburn. I got it covered. Uh, Zoe, run! Where's Sharon? Where's the book? I don't know. What are you doing? I gave you every chance to do the right thing. I trusted you. And you chose them over me. You've lost your mind. That stunt with the bus? You're supposed to protect people. And you were supposed to do what I asked. The hoax. <laughs> then nothing, Vince. This town doesn't run without me. Even my most loyal deputies know better than ask how or why. That book could bring down a lot of people. Myself included. So I gotta ask. Did you look inside it? I swear, I didn't even look. Well, the thing is, I... I don't believe you. How about I take you in for questioning so we can be sure? <laughs> Where do you think you're going? I just want to ask you a few questions, Vince. Like, uh... What'd you read in there that you didn't want to tell me about? Incident report. Attempted to question witness in motel room. Witness became aggressive and combative. I was forced to electrocute the living shit out of him. Fuck you, Sheriff. Electrocute that asshole. Let's go. 
Look what I found trying to crawl under the back gate. Get off! Well, hello there. Where's my daddy? Wanna go for a ride, Dad? Let her go. I don't think so. She's coming with us until we're far away and safe. I lied for you. I may have just killed a cop because of you. And you thank me by... by taking my little girl? Relax. It ain't personal. Of course it's personal. Look, this is our only chance. We have a kid in the back of the car. Ain't no way the cops will shoot. That is so not my problem. Ain't it? Drop the gun. boy. Jay. You don't have to do this. Lower it? Please. So no one gets hurt. Shit. Thank you. Jay, shoot open that gate and get the truck started. To. I was a little girl once too, you know, but now I've got a family of my own and with her in the car the cops won't shoot Please, please. I don't want to go Wait, you need a hostage? Take me. Yeah, right. After what you just pulled uh, We gotta go Wait, look Look, I'm the lawyer but in Arizona, there's a death penalty here, right? Because if you take Zoe, and anything happens, no jury's gonna let you off for that. But if, if it's me, if I come willingly, maybe I was even in on it. He's making sense. Fine, let's just go already. Go on, then. God, Zoe. Come on. You're with us. I have to leave, Pumpkin. Please don't go. Please. Just look after Mommy for me, okay? Okay. And hey, if I don't make it back, you always stand up for the people you love. Okay? Let's go. Here. Please, you need to see in the dark. I love you, Zoe. Oh, oh, all the way to the moon. Say you're the reinforcements. Lawrence Bradley, FBI. Jesus, this was a massacre. The sheriff was found unconscious. Everyone else was caught in the blast. We've got four deputies dead. Maybe more after the burns they took. And no sign of the perps. Let's get a helicopter in the air. That's it. Nice and quiet till we're past the tracks. I tell you, if Bear could see us now. Don't talk about him. This is all his dumb fault anyway.
It wasn't always like that, you know? It's strange where life can take you. Jay, eyes on the road. <sighs> the place I want is the edge of darkness, where thoughts stop and memories die. Do you hear that? <sighs> Step on it! Ma, what do I do? We'll make it. Just keep driving. It isn't working. It never does. I get a few seconds of peace. Then instinct takes over. Just the motel, but what happened afterward? I won't sleep much tonight. I never do. I'll try again tomorrow. Go tell that long tongue liar. Go tell that midnight rider. Tell the gambler, the rambler, the backbiter. Tell him that God's gonna cut him down. Tell him that God's gonna cut him down. Let me tell you the news My head's been wet with the midnight dews Now I've been down on bended knees Talking to the man from Galilee My God spoke, he spoke so sweet Thought I heard the shuffle of angels' feet He put one hand upon my head Great God Almighty, let me tell you what he said Tell that long-tongue liar Go tell that midnight rider Tell the gambler, the rambler, the backbiter. Tell him the guy's gonna cut him down. Tell him the guy's gonna cut him down. You may run and hide, slip and slide, try to take the moat from your neighbor's eyes. But sure there is the rich and poor, you're gonna reap my brother what you sow. You may run on for a long time, run on for a long time, run on for a long time. Sooner or later God'll cut you down.